Goodfellas, New York, Italian Deli, Glassboro, NJ. Last stop on a day of cheesesteaks and drinking with Amigo Dan. It's an Italian deli. I saw Cheesesteak Italiano on the menu. We called in our order. The young lady answering the phone was a joy. We got the Cheesesteak Italiano. We were in Glassboro, so the plan was just to go over to Bonesaw Brewing. They were packed, so we left there. Yeah, we're two crumpy old men. What are you going to do? We thought for something different. We stopped at Belfont Brewing on Marsh Road in Wilmington. They were closed. So we went to one of my favorite places to eat cheesesteaks and drink beer. Wilmington Brew Works. They were open. We even got to see Keith and Craig. Craig being brewmaster extraordinary that has 16 taps and keeps a variety. Something for everyone at Wilmington Brew Works. The cheesesteak traveled well. But unfortunately, there was just way too much garlic on the broccoli, Rob. And that's where our story ends. Dan Cheesecakes, Amigo Dan, Glassboro. Checking out Good Bella's Italian Deli. Is it Godfather's or Goodfellas? Goodfellas, New York Italian. Goodfellas, New York Italian Deli, Glassboro. We brought it up. Oh, we. We took it to Bone Skull, they're busy. Belfont Brewing was closed, so we came here to Wilmington Brew Works. But we like it here. We love it here. It was closer, it would have been our first choice. We actually got to say hi to Craig, the creator. And now, oh, now we can finally get to meet up on camera because. Nobody's around. No one's behind you. Yeah. So I'm going to give you my take on it, and I am i know that we traveled with it for a while, but um, besides the steak being dry and the roll just being standard, there's broccoli rob on this, and the amount of garlic, well, as I said to Jim, he didn't even have to put the steak on there. You can't taste it anyway. My mouth is stinging. Yeah.